Okay, you ready for your, your new duty? Yeah. Alright, well let's take the yeah. bell apart. This is Calypso ship's bell. And Reese, his responsibility is cleaning it up. Right now it needs a little bit of love. Can that little thing come out of there? Yeah. Not good? Yeah, it's perfect. Today we've got some preventative maintenance for you. Not to mention, we'll get attacked by submerged special forces. Seriously, I'll enjoy some more morning sickness. Isn't this fun? We'll get a first look at our baby and we're off to grab our newest crew member. Let's do it. Hi, how you doing? Nice to meet you. We got Lucy. Just give me like the Brazilian butt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> You got it? Yes. All right, you got it. Let's see what's going on in here. Hello. Hi. Are you blow drying? I'm blow is, drying. Is today a good day or a bad day? Today's a good day. Oh. I was able to shower, do my makeup. It's still early. I still haven't gotten dressed. Yeah. But. At the end of my pregnancy, I'm gonna throw this out because I'm gonna be so sick of it. I got Reese working on the ship's bell. Yeah, that's and perfect. I'm gonna fill the boat up with diesel with tanks. Yeah. Maintenance never stops when you live aboard. While servicing wenches, Jeremiah disassembles them, cleans them, and greases the parts. One note is being sure to only oil the paws and not grease them. Getting Reese involved keeps him entertained and teaches him skills for the future. Plus, it's pretty cool to see him be proud of his work. That's pretty wow. Good job, the ship spells back where it belongs. So one night, this happened. How cool is that, right? We were just relaxing when we noticed all these green glowing objects floating in from the inlet. Oh. These are U.S. Navy SEALs training. They were dropped off somewhere outside the inlet. They swam in, collected who knows what, and then left, all without surfacing. He went right on the dock. <laughs> oh, you can see him. Reese, he's right on the dock. He's deep in there. Yeah. He's like under their boat. There he is. Look, you can go there, Reese. Go ahead. Reese loves military stuff, so this was an amazing treat. Thank you guys for all you do. Dad, say hi. <laughs> <laughs> I think he can pull it down. Yeah, he's trying to pull it down. He's trying to get. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Look, there's one over there too. See? Oh, they're coming over to us. Yeah. You know who they are? Navy SEALs. Yeah. We have Navy SEALs diving out of the marina tonight. Well, we can say bye byes to all of our meat. Goodbye, meat. Oh, man. So, not only has the water maker slowly been disintegrating on us. Again. Uh, our freezer is, uh, what's it, like the temperature's going up and down between 20 to like yeah. 30 something. 
Got this little gauge over here. Coastal climate temperature sensor. This is the freezer. Normally we keep it about 20, 19 or 20. It's been going up and down, so I think it's slowly dying. Yeah, everything kind of like thawed and then yeah. froze again, so I don't really well, know. Well, it's doing it repeatedly, yeah. Yeah, so we don't want a chance that we're gonna throw out all of our meat, which kind of sucks, because John, Captain John, our best friend, sent us, see like that's kind of like sticky and so. Yeah, we can't we can't put that on there. Well, it'll be devastating. It's okay, because we've eaten a good amount. He yeah, doesn't want us to eat it and get sick anyways. Yeah. We are going off the dock for a week. I'm kind of like, oh, great, you know, because I can't keep chicken and stuff like that in the fridge for a week, so mm -hmm. I really don't know what we're gonna do. Mm. We'll be fine. We have two fridges, we'll be good. Yeah, we have two fridges. Maybe I'll meal prep and cook some stuff ahead of time. But yeah, just in the meantime, I'd like to talk about that little poking belly you have there. <sighs> that cute little dress. Pregnancy looks good on you. I'm almost 11 weeks. Um, it's been great. The nausea is kicking my ass. We are going off the dock here in a few days and I'm just like, I lay there awake at night like, oh my gosh. You feel what? Isn't this fun? No. Are you having fun? Brittany's been sick for days. Hold on, let me turn on the lights so you don't look like a, you look like a, like a vampirina. Oh, hello, how are you feeling? Pretty awful. She's been morning sick for days. She. Mine happens. At night. Yeah, after dinner. <laughs> Remember when you were like, let's have a baby. Oh, it's so beautiful. I'm gonna enjoy every second. Well, enjoy it, baby. I'm actually happy that you're filming me so we can look back and you can remind me of how awful it You know you don't remember the pain and stuff. You don't. You no. forget how terrible you feel. You, you're you doing great. Keep it up. My mouth's just like salivating. Don't try to turn me on. Just keep it up. <laughs> I can hear people next to me partying. Oh, they're, having, they're having a great time over there. Drinking? Yeah. And I like can't get, I feel like I'm going to throw up. <laughs> Oh, you're gonna love it. You're gonna love pregnancy. You keep on sitting in here watching your TV shows and making a baby. Yeah, I will. I feel like I, I probably spend 14 hours straight in the bedroom. Yeah, I know. Come in here after dinner. I know, you're so lazy. <laughs> you can do it. You can do it! I don't know, you don't know how bad it is. It's easy for you to say. Let's We're gonna see. try. Let's see the side profile. I think oh. you're showing a little bit. Yeah, like that doesn't look good. Side profile? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's see, there you go. Mm -hmm. Just dropped Megan off at the airport. She will be missed. You guys gonna miss her? Yeah. How about you, Reese? Yeah. She'll have a nice flight home. And now we're headed to my first ultrasound. We'll hear the heartbeat. Um, I was able to find a spot a couple minutes away from the airport. They were able to get me in really quick I was kind of worried about that trying to find an OB to get me in usually it's like week long weeks long waiting list to months um, not that I'll be using this one forever I just needed someone to get my first appointment in and we're doing it Yep. they don't let other people come in with you so I'll be going in solo yeah it's ridiculous um, I'll take a video though and hopefully end up with some pictures. We're very excited. This is our first look at the baby. It's too soon to see if we have a boy or girl, but that's okay. Are you ready? I'm ready. I'm excited. You gonna meet, meet the new baby? Yeah, I'm gonna figure out who's been making me feel so sick. Yeah. Good luck. Sorry, I can't come with you. This is the first. That's all right. War doesn't hold me back, but. Right? right. Shouldn't be too long. All right, well, we'll be here. Goodbye, you two. <laughs> I'm like locked in. It's a bit more challenging to get these appointments when you travel full time. A lot of offices won't even take you unless you're going to be there full term, but we lucked out with this Miami location. Who would have thought I'd be having a baby while sailing on a boat? I wonder if this is gonna be challenging. <laughs> What do you think, buddy? Are you excited? A little bit, yeah. About the baby? Yeah. You, you excited about being a big brother? Kinda. You're always the little brother. Now you're going to be a big brother, too. I, I like being the little 
little brother. Well, you're still a little brother. To Trevor. Yeah. Now you're going to be somebody's hero, too. Mm. It's so exciting. Yeah, yes. Hello there, little baby. Even though I was alone, it was amazing to see the baby and hear the heartbeat for the first time. Is that the body? Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, that's the whole baby. <laughs> oh, what's so, the thing next to it? This here? Yeah. That's called the yolk sac. Kind of goes along with the baby at the beginning, kind of gives the baby nutrition at the beginning. That was nice. It's definitely become more real. I got to see the baby, hear the baby's heartbeat. Um, it looks just like a little peanut um, and everything looks good. So I still have a long ways to go. Um, doctor was great. He also had great reviews online. I was surprised that I got in so quickly. He wants to see me back in 12 weeks and I'm like, hmm, probably not gonna happen. I think I'm gonna be skipping around, which I don't really like. When I'm about five months pregnant, I'll probably get more serious about finding a doctor and getting settled and being where I need to be. Um, I'll just do random checkups, but if I did live here in Miami, in Coconut Grove, I would definitely deliver with him. So that's nice. Good doctor. Here she comes. She just texted me. How exciting. I know. It, it looked like a little motocross racer. Oh, you could tell from the little yep. peanut? Yeah. I saw like something wave and I was like, maybe that's a, a boy. <laughs> Obviously not, it's like this big. You like the video? I love it. Oh, good, good. Well, congratulations, nice. sweetie. Thank you. So Lucy's coming today. She is. Let's look at uh, her room. Is it all set up? It's all set up. Oh, it's like a five-star resort. Right? There it is. We left her a coin. Uh, now she gets a sticker that says crew, because she'll be a part of the crew, and a boat card. Yeah, we have those special edition stickers. Yeah, awesome. so I think this is fine. So she has the bed, we have food packed away in the cubbies, and then we assume like she has the option to put her stuff here on the bottom bunk, like a little closet. And then her own bathroom, I cleaned everything, so we're ready. Yeah. Weather looks good, right? Weather looks really calm. We should be able to make it out to the Drive Tortugas and some beautiful anchorages. So I'm looking forward to all that. Well, we'll get to put up our parasail if it's light winds. No, well, our, our spinnaker. Our spinnaker. Yeah, on the spinnaker. But um, yeah, hopefully. She is actually lives in Fort Lauderdale. So she took the Greyhound bus from... The Greyhound? Yeah. Damn. From Fort Lauderdale or Miami. I think she did Miami. So maybe hardcore. Yeah and she's taking it down here and when i looked like tickets are only thirty dollars nice that's a cheap trip yeah, if you think key about West it trip. yeah that's great you excited yeah okay <laughs> that was uh, very enthusiastic hello lucy texted and we are on the way to go get her we passed the car yet nope she has a son and a daughter but the son i believe is in his 20s, um, so much older, but she still remembers what it's like. <laughs> we interviewed Lucy over Skype and we've talked a bunch in the meantime. We think she'll be a great fit for the crew and we're so excited to meet her. It was a quick five minute drive to the station where we picked her up. How was your trip? Hi, how, how you doing? You? Nice to meet you. Maybe too. Yeah. Oh, good? Yeah, trip was good. awesome. Oh, good. Best choice, better than Driving by myself. Good. Going the entire ride. Yeah. Didn't bring too much stuff. <laughs> no, you're fine. All right, we got Lucy coming in behind us, going to the boat for the first time. She said she had a fabulous trip down here in the Greyhound. Right? You said it was good, right? It was awesome, beautiful. She said she preferred that over driving, which is really nice. We'll hop on the boat here. It was time to introduce her to Calypso and get settled in. She has a little welcome it's for you guys. Oh, that's so nice. Amazing. I hope you like so it. Sweet. It's just oh, a, would love it. a little thing that uh, I went to Brazil and I got you something. What? Uh, and you went to Brazil just to get this for us? <laughs> <laughs> to be honest, I went to Brazil to, you know, have fun, visit well, family, okay. and I thought uh, about you, of no, course. Very nice. So oh. I got you this, and this is for you, Jeremiah. 
this is kind of special. This is from Quito, Ecuador, when we're at the embassy on one of the marine balls. Oh, that's oh, great! My goodness. Yeah, Check that, that is cool. It's Quito, Ecuador, and it's it's one of their marine yeah. balls. You know, it's yeah, their, marine. It's yeah, their yeah. anniversary, their birthday. So oh, that's, that's that's what so it says nice. right there. Yeah, absolutely. That is cool, and we have a collection. Yeah. Of oh, yeah? All the glasses. Yeah, that's oh, really yes. cool. Yeah. yeah. That is yeah, so. Yeah, because when you go to the ball, there's glass. Yeah. The glass. That's really cool. Mm -hmm. And Thank this is the mitad del mundo over here. So if you Google it, it's in the middle of the world, no, la mitad del mundo, the Ecuador line. Yeah. So that's it's the symbol that they have when you go oh, visit the area over there. That's uh -huh. their oh, symbol. That's so neat. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, sweet. And I don't know if it's uh -oh. going to fit you, but... <laughs> it's oh, a I Brazilian it. bikini. So. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh, I love the colors. Right? Look at that. I said, she's blonde. I think that color is going to look pretty. Oh, I yeah. love it. It's so cute. That's Thank great. You. That's so nice I of you. It. That's so sweet. Just give me like the Brazilian butt. Yeah. Because <laughs> it has this, so it's going to yeah. bring everything up. There we go. <laughs> we spent the rest of the evening making dinner and just getting acquainted, which was so easy to do. Coming up. And I call my husband to tell him so far how the experience has been and make him jealous. Now I go one, that was two. <laughs> We're off the dock, headed for more adventure. Come on, balls. You're in the way. <laughs> oh, yeah. This looks amazing. I'm <laughs> part of shooting the trees. <laughs> Rocking and rolling oh. up there. I feel like I'm not gonna throw up. I just told Lucy, I was like, yeah, just don't touch the coral because it could be fire coral. And I like went and hugged it with my leg. <laughs> Let's practice when you're at the ball. When you're at Calypso, then you show me again. And then we'll have our worst night at anchor yet. Now the other boat is probably broken free. Ooh, in the water, oh my lord. Want more? Check us out at lazygeckos.net. Remember, patrons can get complimentary access. You can also visit our Vimeo channel. The link is below. Don't forget to click subscribe to get all of the fun. See you next week.